good morning students uh, now we are going to uh, calculate the inductance and capacitance using matlab the theoretical calculation we have already completed in the last video correct so i have taken the same problem so for this problem uh, i just review or recap all the things what we have discussed in the theoretical calculation correct so this is the given data given data are in inches so we are converting in uh, into meter correct so then this is the formula for inductance in terms of milli henry per kilometer correct this is the gmd formula which you are going to enter all these formula in the matlab programming correct so gmd this is the gmr formula and then uh, self gmd of each faces and self gmd of the bundled conductor for inductance as well as um, capacitance will be calculating and distance between the conductors are calculated based on the pythagoras theorem okay just will be calculating all the distances so this also discussed in the last video okay then finally uh, gmd and gmr of the uh, inductor so l value based on this calculation we got 0.45 milli henry per kilometer okay this is what we are going to um, justify our answer using matlab so to find capacitance also uh, this is the formula we are going to enter all this formula in the matlab and then this is the self gmd of the capacitance correct so then self gmd of the bundled conductors for the capacitance calculation so similarly self gmd of capacitor is calculated uh, substituting in this formula you'll get 0.02536 microfarad per um, kilometer uh, students what first no i have to um, just go for new uh, script file i have to open new script file there i'll be typing all these programs here so i have to get the uh, distance between the conductors so input is a uh, keyword which gets the input clear so in what whatever i give within a single code that will be displayed in the uh, script clear then uh, see enter the spacing between a1 and b1 slash n so uh, if i put a slash n this input will be typed in the next line slash n for the next line so i am taking 15 uh, distances so i have to give this input these distance calculations um, or spacing between the conductor c1 and c2 like that these spacings are already calculated by me in the last video correct just see uh, to get those values and then uh, spacing is given in terms of inches the inches are converted into meter as i solved in the problem similarly diameter is uh, converted into meter and then gmd is dab uh, multiplied by dbc multiplied by dca cap power 1 by 3 correct this is a power 1 by 3 cap is representing power okay then i am expanding what is dab what is dbc what is dca correct so i just see i just included the formulas here and then gmr formula which in theoretical calculation i have given this as ds only correct so ds of the bundled conductor this is a formula these are all simply formulas whatever i have used in that the finally then l value is 0.2 multiplied by ln in the matlab instead of ln no uh, i have to type this as log natural logarithm uh, the keyword for that one is log okay gmd by gmr for the inductance gmr l then once all the values are calculated if i put display of l means l value will be displayed because the value is stored in l clear yeah. then again uh, to calculate capacitance i need uh, this is gmr of the capacitor clear yeah. so simply r multiplied by d d is the uh, bundle spacing okay so now uh, self gmd of phase a phase b phase c is calculated using this formula and then gmr of capacitor then formula for the capacitance is given then um display of c 
display of Siemens, uh, whatever the value stored in C will be displayed here. Correct? Now I run, press this run button so that it asks for uh, spacing between A1 and B1, uh, which I have already calculated from this value. See here, um, spacing between A1 and B1 is 7.5 to 1. Okay. And if I press enter, it asks for another distance. So another distance is 15.43 A1 B2. Mm. Then the next distance will be 15.89. So press enter. 15.89 is the distance between A to B1. And then um, distance between A to B2 is 6.809. Again, if I enter B1 C1. B1 C1 is also calculated. Then B1 C2 15.43. Then B2 C1 15.89. If I press enter, it asks for the next input. So, like that, we have to give 15 distances. Okay, spacing between B2 and C2. All these distances are already calculated theoretically. Okay. So enter the spacing between C1 and A1. Okay. And then C1, A2. It's a 12.5. And then it, uh, it the next will be enter the spacing between C2 and A1. See here C2 and A1. Okay. Mm. Then the next will be C2, A2. I'll check it out. See here, C to A to. Then, spacing between A one and A two is seventeen point eight eight nine seven. Spacing between B one B two is sixteen point five. Spacing between C one and C two is seventeen point eight nine seven. Spacing between the bundle conductor is 18 inches, correct? Inch. Diameter is 1.427. So, all the inputs required we have given and it now it calculates for L value which is 0.4498 and capacitance value is 0 0.0259. Uh, this value will be in milli Henry per kilometer and microfarad per kilometer per kilometer okay let's verify your answer okay point not two five is the capacitance and the inductance is point four five okay thank you all for watching this video